Some investors fail to maximize returns from mutual funds due to various factors. The question stands how far is this aimed at? Hi everybody. One prevalent reason is the lack of thorough research and understanding of the mutual funds they choose. Insufficient knowledge about the fund's underlying assets, management strategy and historical performance can lead to suboptimal investment decisions. The high fees impact the overall returns of the investment in following way. Number 1 is expense ratio impact. The expense ratio representing the annual cost of owning a mutual fund as a percentage of assets under management directly reduces overall returns. Higher expense ratios lead to a greater portion of returns being absorbed by fees. Number 2 is compounding effect. Over time the compounding effect of high fees became evident as the fees were deducted annually diminishing the base investment amount and consequently limiting the potential for compounded growth. Number 3 is comparative analysis. Investors could access the impact of fees by comparing the returns of high fee mutual funds to similar funds with lower expense ratio. Such a comparative analysis would highlight the extent to which fees influence overall returns. Number 4 is long term erosion. High fees had a prolonged and accumulative effect on overall returns leading to a gradual erosion of the investment value over an extended period. This erosion was particularly pronounced in cases where the investors held on to funds for the long term. Number 5 is alternative investment opportunities. The money spent on fees represented a missed opportunity for alternative investments or could have been reinvested for potentially higher returns. Evaluating these missed opportunities helps the true cost of high fees. Number 6 is investor awareness. Understanding how aware investors were of the impact of the fees on their overall return is crucial. Lack of awareness might indicate a need for better financial education regarding the significance of fee consideration in investment decision. Number 7 is impact on global achievement. Assessing how high fees affected the investor's ability to achieve their financial goals provide a practical measure of the tangible consequences. Number 8 is adjustment and correction. Analyzing whether investors made adjustments or corrections to their portfolio in response to the negative impact of high fees indicate that adaptability and ability to learn from the fee related challenges. Number 9 is communication with financial advisors. Understanding whether investors discussed fee implications with their financial advisors provides insight in the role of professional guidance in fee conscious decision making. Effective communication with advisors may contribute to a better fee management. And number 10 is regulatory compliance. Examine the investor's adherence to regulatory guidelines regarding fee transparency and disclosure ensures that they were well informed about the fees associated with the mutual fund investment. Compliance with regulations contributes to a transparent and ethical investment environment. Hope you like the video. Let's unlock together your full potential and achieve remarkable success in the world of business. If you are new to the channel, do like, share and subscribe for more such content related to business and finance. Till then, goodbye everyone.